most of this was like way over my head. So uh, honestly, I'm a carpenter. Uh, we restore hips and knees and remove old parts, put in new parts. Uh, so a lot of this was a lot of basic science or, or uh, high level science uh, that was geared towards restoring joints. For me, it's very enlightening, very educational. We're all about restoring joint health in patients. And there's definitely an angle in which regenerative medicine has a role. I think it's still in its infancy, but there's some really cool research that's going on in terms of delaying joint disease and also restoring cartilage health. Is it where it needs to be in 2019? I think there's still opportunity to grow and, and, and gain, uh, but I'm hopeful. I think, you know, based on what I'm hearing in the meeting and hearing these brilliant scientists, I know that that we at some point will get to that point. Back in the old days, patients would stay in the hospital for four or five days, and now uh, they're in the, in the facility or hospital for four to five hours. Uh, so recovery has come a long way. Down the road, there could be biologic replacements, biologic implants, uh, you know, actual implants that are coated with articular cartilage that can restore uh, disease joints. Um, we're not quite there yet, but I think we'll get there someday.